Hello everyone, welcome back to Fury Time channel. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for supporting me, guys. Famous British promoter Eddie Hearn criticized the current WBC heavyweight champion Tyson Fury for his performance in a fight with the Cameroonian Francis Ngannou, which took place on October 29 in Saudi Arabia. A lot of people felt that Fury let boxing down. If you want to participate in such battles, you must understand that your legacy will come to an end if something goes wrong. And you have to understand that Fury's legacy is a defeat by a guy who has never boxed. He is a kind of side to read great for a generation, but is he is so now? Definitely not right now. No one will put Fury on a par with Muhammad Ali, Joel Lewis and Jack Dempsey, and even before that, he was a kind of side to read great only by casual fans and people with the scant knowledge about boxing, he didn't say it. Famous British promoter Reddy Hearn spoke about the WBC World Heavyweight Champion Tyson Fury after his fight with uh, Francis Nagano. This fight took place on October 29th in Rodia and ended with Tyson's victory by a split decision of the judges. I wouldn't be surprised if Fury ends his career and doesn't fight. A few days after the fight there is some kind of race, but then there is a decline. And uh, how long will it take him to overcome it? Hearn said. The former world champion in four weight, the legendary American Roy Jones Jr., spoke about the recent fight before the French Cameroonian mixed martial arts Francis Ngannou and the WBC heavyweight world champion Tyson Fury. The victory was won by a separate judicial decision based on its results by Fury. According to Jones, immediately after the fight, he felt that Ngannou could have given the victory. Now Roy Jones believed that for his final verdict, he should reconsider the fight. It was assumed that Nagano would not be able to succeed with Fury, but he did. He even knocked Fury down, and Fury could not do it with Francis. With that said, many people have the idea that Nagano should have won the fight. I probably felt the same way when I left the arena. However, I haven't reviewed the fight yet. I think I need to watch it again to form an opinion. But my initial thoughts were that Nagano might have to be recognized as the winner, John said. And if it were champion Shakur Stevenson criticized the British heavyweight boxer Tyson Fury for his fight against Francis Nagano, and also said he did not believe that Fury approached the fight responsibly. I don't believe that he says he trained for 12 weeks. He didn't look like he was training. It didn't seem like he directed a lot of punches, although he does it all the time. He seems very indecisive, and I know what a good shape he was in before. I'm usually a big fan of Tyson Fury, but he didn't look too good that night, Stevenson said. Former UFC champion Francis Nagano, who on the night of October 29 held his first boxing match against Tyson Fury, said that the most desirable option for him for the next fight is a rematch with Fury. Revenge is what I want most of all. Today I felt that there were many options for me, but I want to choose wisely, and for a start I would go for a rematch. My best option is to wait for Fury. I will fight Fury, then I will let them do whatever they want. Gano said. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.